We're going to join Dick and Potsy and Bud right here on this set. Right here live at, that's right, Lurleen's Beauty Box. Remember, put a little... So are we rolling now? Have we started yep. now? Hey, what? kids. We're on the air, Potsy. Hi, Dick. How you doing, Potsy? We're so happy. We've been broadcasting for Lurleen's Did you hear that Lurleen's for so long, and Lurleen is finally back. And now she's with us. How about that? Hey. Hey, Lurleen. That's great to see you. Hi, you. You're What's looking your real name? good. Me? I'm Ralph Bailey. Oh, That's Hi. right. Hey, you, Ralph. Good to see you. Hey, bud. How you doing? The How's it going? To talk to you. We've missed you, good. Lurleen, since doing you've good. been gone. Doing Where have you been? Good. Well, you know, I was in Daytona for bike week. Biking. And What'd you I, say, bud? Well, to tell you Biking. the truth, things oh. didn't sound so good back in Atlanta. I wasn't so anxious to get back. I heard that y'all was scaring off all the business and stuff. My things God. were slow around the slow around the beauty box. Excuse and me. so I, well, I'd met, you know, a new friend down in Daytona, and I hitched a ride with him up to New York. Ooh, ooh. Did y'all see Geraldo? Did you see Geraldo when you were up there? Well, no. I like Oprah. But ooh. I hitched a ride with him, and I went shopping, you know. I, I picked up all kinds of beauty tips. You know, New York is the beauty capital Wow, well, look at here. Look. Well, here they are. They're still in here. Hey, Lurleen. Hey, girl. Hey, honey. How you doing? I love that T-shirt. Thank you. You know, oh. my sister sent me this. My sister in Nashville. I looked all over Daytona for them. Well, she sent it to me. She got it up in Nashville. But, you know, we're just so glad that you're back here, honey, because I'm telling you that we've had nothing but trouble out of these TV, well, these TV crew. That's why know. I stayed away, baby. Honey. I've been keeping in touch with Miss Honey. Girl, honey, honey Miss Lovejoy, Miss Lovejoy, she run out of here. She run out of here. Miss Homebody, too much Debbie like too much scared Debbie normal. Scared her. They like to scare her. Well, those are two of our best customers. I know it. You tell them, girlfriend. You tell them. And I, I, after I saw that shattered. videotape of Virginia shattered. McClendon, when they let her come on and look like that, I didn't think they was going to show that. Put they swore. Y'all swore you was going to enter With her head looking that. like that, Missy. She called me up crying. She, and Betty Jack Devine, she called up and she said she wasn't going to come in here if they were going to show her head on there like Virginia. Called me up. I didn't know what to do. Girl, we missed you. We if missed you. If there's one thing I would never want to do, it's hurt Virginia McClendon's feelings. Mm. She is mm. the sweetest woman on this earth. She's Virginia, a dreamboat. I'm sorry if you're watching. She's got a bad haircut, They're but she's going. sweet. They're going. the last week. Lurleen, yes. you don't have to worry because we have hired a professional advertising executive to come in here and in payment for allowing us to use your studio. Who? She's design uh, advertising campaign for your store that's going to make you the number one salon in Atlanta. I ain't ever needed no advertising up to now. It's all been word of mouth and it's been fine for a few years. Well, honey, many, it's going to take years. something to build the business back up after what the beauty box has been through with all this TV show going on in here. It's going to take something to build it back up to what it used to be. Now, this girl. This is going to open up whole new markets. I mean, they're going to do demographic studies and stuff and market studies. And, and it it's wasn't really our fault. Just a whole new audience. And we're even, I mean, it's... We're getting this done, and it's part of our insurance settlement for the bombing on and the other And it's not studio. our fault that someone bombs our studio and people really didn't works. want to come oh, here. Right. We don't want, I don't want no focus what groups. What happened with Lurleen, the Lurleen, you tell I don't think that works so much, all that groups. demographic Don't bring no focus stuff. groups in here. No, no we ain't going to stand for none of that. No, we don't care for focus groups either. We won't do that. Well, they've Whatever already, kind of focus groups or demographic groups, I don't know. They've already done all the marketing studies about it, bud. What? They've already done the marketing study. Oh, they have. What was it? Well, we're going to find out, because as soon as we watch well, the condensed we version get? of RuPaul, Larry T, and La Homa on the Geraldo they show. They were. That was last I week, got, right? We took a week off got another vacation or something. coming up. I can't handle too much new business. I like well, Let's take a look customer. at that, Dick, because we're short on time tonight. And we've got, we're we a jam-packed show. We're going to take a look back. This at RuPaul on the Geraldo. We're gonna make so we want to introduce Lurleen to the ad agency executive we've picked to redesign the campaign for Lurleen's Beauty Box. Hi, Mr. Richards. I'm Rachel Goulet. Oh, hi. Hi, nice Lurleen. I'm Rachel Goulet hey, from Rachel. the agency. Miss Goulet, how are you? And what agency are you from? I'm from Swern's Cut Rate Advertising Agency. And what kind of surveying have you done about Lurleen's Beauty Box? Well, we've done a survey that's shown that this particular beauty shop is in a bombed-out area. and uh, so. You knew that. 
And also, there seems to be some sort of a transient television show going on here, but and I haven't seen any evidence of it yet. Yeah. Flattering pictures of the Miss Mosley done canceled. Miss Tati Mosley done called up and canceled just That's now, Lurley. Ooh, Ooh so this is an example of why we need to institute a brand new ad campaign. And that's because this is in a bombed out area. People are afraid to come here. There's a transient television show in this premises, and people just don't want to come that's down us, here. That's us. So what we've decided it's is transient. that this, people on the move. this particular beauty box needs a spokesperson who is a standard in the community, and that standard is Mr. Ralph Bailey. <laughs> He's the dean. <laughs> we've he chosen don't live Mr. Ralph here. Bailey. What community? He don't live in this neighborhood. That doesn't matter to the. That's what's the ruining the business around here. Is them the outsiders people who watch coming advertising in and scaring don't know off that. They see Ralph Bailey. Customers. He's the figure in the community. Everybody knows Ralph Bailey. They'll all come out here and get their hair done at Lurleen's. I'm telling I you, it will it. work. It I will don't work. buy it. Well, we've done already wait, done a pre-survey, and it shows that everyone would come and and get their hair done here if Ralph Bailey were the advertiser. Lurleen. No, Ralph, you're real sweet. I don't mean you no harm. Lurleen. Now, Lurleen. see, Lurleen. little girl, you're Lurleen. sitting there in a, a little piece of underwear, and you're not even Gosnell supposed to be Gosnell wearing clothes she's like not that. Coming in. It's Gosnell. That's right. No! Lurleen. Lurleen. Now, listen to what uh, the advertising person has to say, the whole campaign. Okay. Well, now, what will happen is we're going to be doing a spot that we've already cut a little bit of, and we're going to be showing it to you. And, um... I believe that you're going to be participating in the new campaign if I have my judgment right, and I, I think that you'll go along with it once you see what we have in mind. Why have your hair done by people like this? Once seen in this bombed out shell of an area. Hey, everybody! Hey, my boyfriend Bubba's taking me down. We're going to the tractor pool! <laughs> it sounds like fun, but no good for the hair. Well, here's what you'll find at Lurleen's today. Mr. Slippy De Tongue, internationally known hair products manager. I ain't answering none of your questions, Dad. Your stupid questions, they make me furious. And that's the kind of intimacy that you'll find here at Lurleen's. Lurleen's Beauté Box. Where you can put a little beauty in your box in a serene and tranquil environment. This is Ralph Bailey for Lurleen's Beauty Box. Lurleen, that was a pretty uh, fancy advertising campaign we arranged for you. Well, the number was pretty nice, but I didn't like that ad at all. It, it was full of lies and dishonesty and cheating. I didn't like that man. Lies. I didn't. Who is this Pepe Le Pew? He don't work here. He ain't ever going to work here, Virginia McClendon. You can rest easy. I ain't got no Susie Furners working here. And Janelle, she still works here. Now, and I'm burning up. Thank you. I'm advertiser changing advertiser out of this. Come in to have an appointment. Do you care whether or not the advertisement is true? The phones are just ringing off the hook with people making appointments. I can't believe it. If it's somebody that has a name that's it. worth going to, then you know it's true. Janelle, they want to fire right. you. See, they said they you were fired on that ad, you dumb ass. You weren't even because paying Ralph attention. Bailey they said you were the fired. This advertising lady, you're well, uh, you uh, Ralph fire Bailey, me another fabulous success for you in advertising. Janelle is here, and she. Well, good jobs come and go, but it looks like 1990 is going to be a good year for Lurley and a good year for me. Ralph's done better than you. Ralph, we need a second night. It looks like it's going to be a second night here soon. Yeah, uh, uh, Ralph, Potsy, good night, Potsy. Uh, enjoy it. Good night, everybody. Come on down. See you again next week, Ralph. I don't you listen to her. She, she don't have nothing to do with me. No. Congratulations. She's becoming very packed. Phones are ringing off the hook. It's just 